in my mind, uh, Orson Pratt was very smart. He is the one that took uh, the Doctrine and Covenants and literally named the section. You can tell that he's a mathematician. That's uh, our one scriptures that has numbers. It's other scriptures has names, uh, such as Nephi, Alma, Moroni, but for the Doctrine and Covenants. You say section 2, I can tell you the one that's 10 away or 20 away, or I can divide and multiply, and I know exactly which section you're talking about. So I've been actually very grateful for that. As far as, uh, as his mind, uh, it's interesting that Brigham Young saw Orson Pratt as a man with multiple talents. For example, one thing that I liked that kind of shows that he isn't just uh, mathematical or scientific. Brigham Young had him sit outside uh, all the month of April one year. And what he wanted him to do was to literally draw. So suddenly you say Orson's an artist too, but to draw the phases of the moon. And then the phases that he drew uh, represent and are now replicated all around the Salt Lake Temple, uh, which then became our most decorative stones.